Good morning, everybody. I don't know if that took a couple minutes or what, but I was just getting everything set up. But I just kind of wanted to talk real quick about two things that I think are important to when you want to change, right? Two huge tips on this. And I've spent a lot of time working on self-awareness, trying to figure out myself. And in that process, I listened to a lot of, uh, you know, really, really smarter people than myself that have kind of figured some stuff out. And here are the two tips that I have taken away from it. Um, in order to bring true change to your life, it has to start with self-acceptance. You have to accept that there is a need for change. You have to get out of the space of complaining or commiserating, or even, you know, this is how it is. And you have to accept that there is something that you want to be different so that then you could look at it through the lens of, okay, how do I go from the place that I'm in to a different place? The second thing that I know to be true is that in order to change, you have to do something different in your daily routine, right? You can't say, oh my gosh, I really wish I could lose weight, or you know, I really wish that I could make more money, or I really wish that, you know, I could have whatever. So it, Hang on, hang on. Okay. I really wish that I could, uh, you know, be more active. None of those things will ever happen if you don't change something in your daily routine, if you don't change something in your life. So if, if we were to take, you know, I want to be more active. Oh my gosh, I'm overweight. I'm this, I'm that. And, and if that's the self-talk that you give yourself and you don't ever accept, look, I am in a place that is not the best for me. It's what I don't consider the best for me. It's not what other people say. It's what I think that if, if you look at yourself and you say, there is something I want to be better about myself and I accept who I am and I understand where I want to go. Then the next thing you do is you say, okay, what is that first step? What's that? I did it moment that you want to have in your day that helps validate your feelings of, I want to be different. So if we continue with this example and we say, you know, I just want my body to feel better, not necessarily losing weight or looking how I, or changing how I look. I just want my body to feel better. Then do something to make your body feel better. Um, learn about a different way of eating. Learn about a different way of taking care of your body if it's sore. Learn about or try moving, try doing something that might I don't know, be fun or different or with a friend, lots of different things you can do. But if you don't take that step and change something in your day, nothing's ever going to change, right? And oftentimes the reason we don't take that step is maybe because we don't believe that we really want that change or we haven't come to terms with it, that we're willing just to kind of hang out in that world of, you know, I found a Facebook group and everyone complains about this. Everyone complains about their hormones. Everyone does this. And maybe that's soothing to you, but guess what? After all of that time you spend in that group or after all that time you do those Facebook posts, nothing changed. So where did you get? I, I, you didn't get anywhere, right? So if you wanna get somewhere, if you want to change, you have to accept the fact that you want to change and what needs to change. You have to come to terms with that and then you need to change something, right? You need to adjust your daily routine to facilitate that change. So it's pretty straightforward, but. Um, as I was running today, I was thinking, you know, there are some things I want to do better at. So that means that I have to change my running as much as I love going out and doing it every day. If I want it to be a pathway for something different for me, then I need to change it. Right. So I will. Um, maybe I'm still figuring out what that change is going to be, but I've accepted it. I've accepted the fact that what I have done has gotten me to this place. Thank you very much for that. But I want to go someplace different. So now I'm going to. So I hope that helps a little. Um, and I'd like to hear about what you're working on. So just a food for the thought for the day, if that, if that's a lot of us, but, um, that's what it is. And it's a Friday. So I'll see you later. Bye-bye.